Hey everyone, today's book is called Inventing the Telephone by Sue Graves. Long ago, there were no telephones. Instead, people used a telegraph to communicate. The telegraph sent electricity through wires. Telegraph operators used this part of the telegraph to send messages. Electricity from the telegraph made clicks. The clicks stood for letters. Telegraph operators knew how to turn the clicks into messages. This part of the telegraph received messages. Alexander Graham Bell was interested in the telegraph. He thought he could make the telegraph better. Bell knew that electricity from the telegraph made clicks. He thought that electricity could make voice sounds too. Thomas Watson was Bell's helper. One day, he was fixing Bell's telegraph. The machine made a noise. Ping! Bell was in a different room. He heard the noise. It came through the wires. Now Bell was sure electricity could send voices through wires too. Bell and Watson's first telephone. Bell and Watson got to work. They started to make a machine that used electricity to send voices. It was the telephone. Bell's first telephone did not work well. Watson spoke into the telephone. Bell could not hear him. Bell and Watson kept trying. They drew pictures. They used the drawings to make a better telephone. On March 10, 1876, Bell was working on the new telephone. He wanted to tell Watson something. Mr. Watson, come here. I want you, he called. Watson heard him through the telephone in the next room. The invention worked. The first successful telephone. Bell and Watson traveled around the United States with their new invention. They showed people how to use it. Over the years, telephones have become much better. Many telephones don't need wires anymore. Today, Telephones can be used in many places. 1876, 1920s, 1930s, 1970s, 1980s, 2000s. Here a girl is talking. She is saying, Hi, Grandpa. It's good to talk to you.